out of 441 people now at the time of doing this poll 95 percent of you have said no you're not buying these and these are just bulk lands they do have really cool art on them but that is interesting to see that only five percent of what is now 443 people have purchased these so that's some pretty important feedback and just based on this yeah. poll which is a microcosm of the community i would say they're but a very commander and finance minded part of the community look i will i will say i've always asked that these lands when they do the basic land treatments i've always asked yeah. that they come in giant bundles yeah and i want to be able to here. i want to be able to buy 40 swamps you know whatever and right they're doing it here and so for me this number one looks like one that they're not pumping this like crazy they ain't really even talking about this. I see a tweet go out every now and then, and that's all we get. And then two, if this is available all year, I'm going to wait until they start going on about, oh, you're not going to see these ever again. These are going to go away. And then I'm going to go through and I'm going to look and see, okay, do I like this forest? Eh, it's kind of, it's kind of cool. It's not really for me, Yeah. but right. do I like this? Cool. Uh, I, I just saw this really cool one, this mountain. Like if you've got a mono red commander deck, yeah, that mountain has all of your mountains in the deck. I kind of dig kinda that. Cool. And yeah. so at the end of the year, once I've Have seen all cool of swamp? them, maybe yeah. I go and, you know, pick up one or two of these gianter, bigger bundles. Let's look and see if they've made a swamp. That looks like a forest mountain. If they made a, if they made a cool swamp, that's what I'm interested oh, in. Oh yeah, the Taurus one, this was a swamp. Island, island, swamp. Yeah, so they've got two swamps. Nope, this is a forest. I was wrong about that. They got one swamp so far. Oh, that's kind of cool. There is your like that. There is your swamp so far. Yeah, and that's what I'm saying. Popping. Maybe that's how I would engage with this product. Because yeah, it is not shocking to me that more than 95% of the people or 95% of the people who responded tonight have not yeah. purchased these number one there's no time limit limit on them so we've got all year number two they're not really pumping them so they're not really staying in our minds so even if i look at these and go yeah i think i want them if they don't remind me by december i'm definitely gonna forget i ain't gonna buy yeah. them and maybe yeah. even if they remind me i'm not gonna buy them but they maybe just kind of sit there passively and they're like maybe people will, will order these but if i'm an exec and i'm looking at well you know and i know that our community specifically isn't a full sample size here. Right. But if I was like, man, 95% of people, 80% of people uh, of our normal numbers just Ain't have zero it. interest in this, uh, I would be, I'd be discontinuing it. I just wanted to, to kind of respond on that poll there before we forget about it. It's nice to be able to have a community where everybody wants to come in and kind of be part of the uh, experiment. But we have a good idea that not a lot of people are buying these jake and chat answer me answer me this question as well what do you think what how do you think they could have presented these that would make you buy them do you think it's the fact that they're astrology lands that is actually turning you off of them a little bit do you think if they were just rotating through and they were like look this month we're doing mountains we're doing special mountains this is the special mountain we got this artist we're selling a non-foil for 30 a foil for 40 we're selling a five pack five uh so 25 total non-foil for 120 and 25 total foil for 160. yeah how yeah. how could they package this that you would buy it chat let me know you, too you know i'm gonna tell you right out the gate because my gut when you said is the astrology thing turning you off to it a little bit and for me it's yes it's a gut right i, I feel the same I, way it's a gut, gut thing my gut says i'm a little bit turned off to the astrology thing i don't really follow that i don't care about it that right. much right so for me, it's like um, this is supposed to possibly be a, a product that resonates with people that like uh, like the Zodiac symbols or we completely missed the point of it. And Wizards is just trying to do it as like an astrology thing and connect it in some way yeah. to just like, oh, you know, each month we're doing a thing and it's not supposed to be heavily tied into you know the the roots of whatever your symbol is but instead people are are drawing that line anyway and maybe that's what's doing it maybe they could have presented it in a way that was a little bit different i feel like or 
Corey G says maybe a dollar per land. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> would have made more sense. That was going to be one of my things. Is like out of the gate, I feel like if it was cheaper, I'd be less turned off by it because at the end of the day, it is just basics. And I, I like everybody want to pimp out my decks, but not for a hundred and twenty dollars for twenty five basic lands. I mean, you got to right. plus shipping on top of that. You've got you've got to pull me in some other way and astrology astrology lands gemini ain't the way to do it but if it was like you know here's here's a pete venters mountain here's yeah. a you know here's a dennis malavie however you pronounce their name swamp yeah. and you can buy five of them for 20 bucks and you can buy 25 of them for 60 bucks 70 bucks i'm maybe yeah, buying that premium land you know exactly and let's catch up with chat here a little bit steven says not going to pay 30 dollars for four copies of one sign uh taylor says astrology lands might be awesome if they look cool they'll be scarce but no demand equals low price forever kevin says i think kaleidoscope one is quite good art is very nice three great cards or oh kellogg's loops oh that's a different one yeah um aaron says the astrology thing turns me off no thanks regardless of marketing honestly if it wasn't astrology i'd be more interested says justin and then we have a couple of folks that are saying maximum of, of a dollar per card you know that kind of thing yeah but, it seems yeah, interesting <laughs> i would love to see and we'll never get to see this but i would love to see their purchased out on these if these have been worth it for them or if they are just like pot committed and have to finish out the year because they said they would do one for every month and this was already yeah. planned i just kind of wish that kind of wish that they had been presented in a different way maybe a different border maybe come up with something new there differentiate them a little bit the thing is is that full art lands aren't special anymore when that started they were they were the bee's knees you cool guy and now right it's like Wild every Cat set that yeah exactly full art basics aren't special anymore they're in every set right yeah yeah exactly exactly wildcat i couldn't agree more and so if you're gonna if you're going to give us the option to do something i've asked for which is provide me a bigger pack of these lands i can buy so that i can actually fill out a deck you know, let me, I know you have the technology to do it, Wizards. Let me come through and be like, I want, I want the Gemini non-foil bundle. I'm just going to use the example of what they've actually got here because I really like this mountain. And then I want yep. the Taurus non-foil bundle because I really like this swamp. So I want 25 of each. Give me a further discount because I'm buying a, a bigger lot of cards. And I'm going to combine multiple layers and just kind of make my own version of, I want to pimp out my... Let's say Prosh deck. So I'm going to get three packs of them actually. So that all my basics in that deck are these special ones. I just think it's a miss. It's just a total miss. And I feel like they know it's a miss. And that's why they don't spend any time covering it. They just want to get through these. They're halfway through the year at this point. And then maybe yeah. they can come at it a different way. And that's why out of 500 people, only 5% of the people that have responded in chat have said, yeah. yes, they're buying this astrology product. So okay, so people in chat that have bought them. Last question and we'll move on from astrology lands. People in chat that have bought them. Why did you buy them? What maybe they what drew like you the astrology to them? thing. Yeah, yeah exactly. Maybe. I want to know what reasoning what your reasoning was you just like them and that's completely fine that's kind of the whole secret layer thing right if you like it buy it i mean yeah this mountain is objectively interesting it's kind of a cool take on mountain especially if you've got like a blue if you've got a red blue deck if you got a red blue green deck this is an awesome mountain for your red blue green deck <laughs> all right so sean says birthday gifts for friends that's a nice so one that's fair. yeah that's fair. yeah uh, Leroy Jenkins or uh, David says for toilet paper. <laughs> I don't think that's the legitimate answer no. we were looking for. No, Richie's saying it's my birthday time. One so X of every secret that layer. Be, that might have been their strategy. That might have been their strategy. Is, yeah. Let's Maybe I buy the September one. People based on birthday. Right. Maybe we'll get people to just buy it yeah. based on the month that they were born. David, like there is, a, and I should say, because in my gut, my gut does respond by saying, you know, in the past when I first saw this, 
I did say I am the tiniest bit interested to see what they do for Libra because I am a Libra. Yeah, there you go. But that's that's it. I'm the tiniest bit interested. All of these have right. cool, unique artwork, but I'm just not interested in picking them all up, especially now that I know what the secret layer model is, which is print a ton of stuff, throw spaghetti at the wall and right. just hope people buy it. I got to tell you, I have not gotten past trying to figure out how you use a magic the gathering card as toilet paper my brain is stuck on that dank fellow libra yeah how do you use one as toilet paper you don't know how to use the three seashells you gotta cup it you gotta like cup it at a corner so that the corner pulls down the most central valley oh your butt will not like that your butt will not like that